to yet another unboxing. This time we're going to be unboxing Megatens. I've got the Yugi and the Kaiba Megaten, and we are going to be unboxing the Yugi for this video. And then I'm going to have another video where we're going to be boxing the Kaiba. So, without further ado, here's the Yugi box. Comes with that nice scythe there on the front. And we got Ebon High on the side. Very nice. Let's crack it open and see what we got. So the promotionals for this are pretty awesome, especially in comparison to previous promotionals. We got that playable Slay Through the Sky Dragon with that original art. We have the original art Dark Magician. Got an Ebon High. Very nice. And then we have DDD. Flame King Genghis. Good old Genghis Count. Also, we have Dragon uh, Dragonox, the Empowered Warrior. Pretty nice. I've never actually looked at that card. And most excited about is this Performable Pendulum Sorcerer. He was pretty expensive previously. The price has gone down since the release of this. He was at 15 not too long ago, and now he's down to 7. Alright, so already promotionals are pretty freaking cool. Next up is the Mega 10 Mega Packs. They have 16 cards. I believe each one comes with a secret rare and ultra rare and rare, or ultra rare, secret rare, super rare, and then a bunch of commons. Let's perform apples. Beginning Night, Tatsunoko, ooh nice, a Black Luster Soldier Super Soldier, never actually had this card before, so that's a pretty good drill, and then from Apple Hot Princess, yeah, the rest of the 12 are all going to be just commons. So what, that's Super Rare, Ultra Rare, Super Rare, and Rare. Spectre, Tornado, and then the dreaded Kirin. <laughs> Let's perform Apple Cards coming out of this. One last Mega Pack to open up. Got some Fluffles and some Gems, Hot Forbidden, Rebel the Summoner, I like that card. There we go. Fluffle Mouse. Ooh, good old Solemn Strike. Very nice pull. Got Assault Blackwing Raikiri. And Tomb Buster Blader. Very nice pools. Nothing too big to write home about, but considering these tins are actually worth $20, it's a very good deal. Alright, be sure to tune in for the Kaiba one as well.